In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the label and ink roller in the Blitz C20 pricing gun. So the first step is to open the top lid by pressing in the two sides of the lid and opening it up. To open up the bottom of the gun, you pull these two sliders on either side down and then you use your finger in here to open up the base plate. That should leave you with a hole straight through the middle of the gun. That's the hole our labels are going to go through. Take your roll of labels and straighten out about 10 centimeters worth of them on the end. And then you feed that 10 centimeters straight through the hole down the middle. The roll of labels should drop down and you can close the lid. That will let you turn the gun upside down and you can pull out about 10 centimeters again from the front of the gun. Uh, one thing that some people do is they try and get the labels caught up in here. You don't do that, just leave them flat out of the front, close the base plate, and then you put these labels around the silver roller and down into the gun. As you do that, hold them there and start clicking. And when the labels become tight here, you just take one off the end, remove those labels, click a few out, and you'll have your label all set up and ready to go. To change the ink roller in any pricing gun, I always like to wear a pair of gloves just because your fingers can get dirty because you're dealing with ink. Uh, with the Blitz C20 in the box, You'll have this little ink roller removal tool here. It just helps. It means you don't have to touch the ink roller when you're getting it out of the gun. Um, to get it out, you open the front of the gun by holding onto these two tabs and just pulling out. So you pull the front of the gun out and that reveals the ink roller just here. And you can use this tool to grab it and then you just kind of jimmy it out of the gun. Have a tissue handy so that you can put it onto a tissue. You would then get the new ink roller out of its little foil and it would come just like this one here and you basically do the exact same thing in reverse. So you open up the front of the gun again, you put the ink roller as close as you can and it should just roll down onto there and this is why I like to use gloves is you can use your fingers to grab on the ends, push down, and it'll clip into place. Then you just close the front of the gun and you're all good to go again.